We'll be making center part traditional hairstyles. They bring our hair on the right hand side, the way I'm going on the video, and then divide hair from the left hand side. Make sure the pattern is in the middle, then braid the both hair you brought out separately. You know, like sectioning it out. After sectioning it out, braid them out. Then the next line of action is to comb the whole hair, comb through the whole hair, make sure that none of the hairs is tangled, make sure every bit of the hair is cotton, make sure they are cotton and that you comb it through. And it's smooth, smoothing that very well, tie with thread, tie with thread and make it very tight, make it firm make it tight and firm then braid up the remaining part of the hair that you tied after braiding it you get a bond the bond we use is a new bond oh losing it i just showed you the the hair wax that i usually use and then the spray gel that i usually use apply the hair wax first brush through very smoothly before spraying the, the, the gel on it then after this section the next thing to do is to bring your bone the bone we use is a new bone but you use it as round as it is you just lose it losing losing the bond tie it on the on the extra hair that you braided out from the packing gel that's the part of the hair you separated from the packing gel. Tie it round. This is my styling muse. I use the muse to get the baby hairs. That's the, to get the edges of the hair well styled. Most of the time, when you use regular gel, it won't give you a perfect edge lining. But when you use um, styling muse, it will give you a perfect hair lining. Losing the, losing the front part of the hair that you sectioned, the one you braided at first, the both side, make sure your pattern is in the middle. This is the bond I talked about. This is how normal it is, but we'll cut it to losing it just to get the volume of what we want and to get the shape of what we want. Use the bubble pin to hold it down, then fold it round on each other get more bone add as much as you can to get the volume of hair you want mind you the bigger the bone the bigger the hair Now get uh, an attachment already braided like Bob Marley twist or box braid twist. Fold it round on the bond you formed on the hair. As you're folding, use your small bubble pins to hold it down. Not the big ones though, the small ones to hold it down. Just keep making a a circle move. Keep making a circle move as, as you're seeing in the video. Now the same thing will be repeated again on a, f from a different angle 
around the whole hair. see the outcome and you get a hair cream a regular hair cream rub it on the hair and then stretch make sure your pattern is in the middle make sure your pattern is in the middle then use your um, cloud nine stretcher i'm using the cloud nine stretcher stretch the hair through just stretch the hair through and curl as 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 uh, I've seen the I use that um gorilla glue to hold the edges. Yes, to hold it firm because only the saline mules can't hold it firm. So I had to apply gorilla glue to do the the other part of the holding. So the way you stretch the other part, stretch this other side of the hair to gently comb, carefully comb, and then you stretch. As you're stretching, getting to the tips, you curl. Or rather you bend your stretcher. I prefer covering your stretcher rather. The spray gel is, is to hold down the tips of the hair on the gel already. That's the tips of, of this uh, newly stretched hair. Then get your beads. Use your big bobby bubble pins to attach it to the hair. Just hold it firm on the hair with the big bubble pins. Stylishly, any way you feel that it's going to look fine on the bride's face. This is the regular um, bead for hair. Then this is a B6000, a glue I use to um, stone beads on hair. So what I do is I cut, the, um, I cut the bead, not to be long, but to be short, the way it is down. It's all these coral um, beads. Apply the glue on it and then fix it on the hair. In strategic points where it will be seen, and it will look beautiful.